Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 47 of Let's Play Dark Cloud, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Now I tried uh, entering my memories right here, but it won't allow me to do so. So I tried entering it in the dungeon itself. Believe it or not, it actually works there. That is so strange, because I never thought you could actually do that. Like, you can actually enter Georama parts in the dungeon, but... Apparently, we can. So, we're 151 years in the past. Alright, so... Why don't we actually press on before we actually work with our Georama here? Let's just clear out this floor. Huh. Diamonds are not forever, bitch. <laughs> I waited so many days to finally come up with that line. And I felt it was well worth it. Hey, we got the key or clock hands right away. Best to get those early. Oh, looks like we needed the pitch dark key. What else is new? Tasty water. It's not as good as premium water, so maybe premium water is not all that tasty. It's just like, oh, well, it's just water, but I feel more quenched. And tasty water probably just has a bit of sugar, so you'll end up still feeling thirsty anyway. Maybe I overanalyze things a bit too much, as per usual. But, eh, whatever. So we'll probably run against all kinds of card enemies here. In fact, they might be the only enemies we fight on this floor. Oh, so let me switch out to Osmond. I feel like his jackal is close to being plus five. So we can turn into a synth sphere for the snail. Again, I feel like the snail is something I want to build up as it will get me closer to his ultimate weapon. And besides, he does need a little bit more airtime compared to other characters. Because they've had their fair share. Even though his weapon itself is a pain in the ass to work with when it comes to, like, charging it and whatnot. But at the end of the day, it's still useful. Okay, the clubs like to block a lot, but the jokers are worse. I still find it weird that the clubs attack very similarly to Goro. To the point they're almost identical. Okay, fair share of Atla over here. Oh, there's a big chest too. It's like when you go to the club, you see, oh, finally a girl with a big chest, but she's probably gonna have a terrible personality. We might find something terrible in here. It's an explosion. Always believe the fish! Also, that's my weapon, so let's give her to something that is quite expendable, like a bone rapier. Ah, a brave arc! There's a new weapon! It's actually very interesting to get one of those in there. I feel like the Brave Arc is probably one of the later weapons in the game. Not an ultimate weapon, but somewhere near that. Oh, we can upgrade it now. I want to take advantage of that. So let's give it like a whole bunch of attacks and speed. There. Oh, it's already maxed. So maybe no more attack. We'll give it endurance then. He looks to be maxed too. So maybe some magic power instead. Right now it doesn't really matter what we give it because we have enough for it anyway. Fine, give it a sea killer too. And of course get that repaired. We don't want to lose it. That would really be shitting the bed. Okay, diamonds apparently don't block. No wonder they're not forever. Because they're not defensive at all. I'm just going to clear out those enemies in chests before I get to the Atla over there. That's definitely a King Mimic over there, or a Mimic King. Oh man, these guys hurt. For hearts, they practically break your heart with that attack. Oops. Oh. Oh, that's so annoying. 
Oh my god, that's still going! Oh Jesus, what have I done? Man, I had to give up weapon HP just to be easier on the ears. Jesus. Who thought that was a good idea? That definitely had to be a bug. Okay, we got black blood. Ew. It's gross. It's all coagulated and stuff. And we got dark power. Which I guess is blackening agent for your blood. And we got blood agreement. I've heard of those. I mean, you know, signing a pact with blood, like being blood sisters, like you prick your fingers, and then when you get to the blood part, you just press the cuts together, or the wounds together. I hear that my, uh, when I was in high school or elementary school when they were doing it, they didn't like it because there's risk of infection. But that's pretty much Darwinism working itself out. I guess the longer it takes, I guess the higher your speed, the less it will deplete. Therefore, you can actually shoot more. So speed might actually be a very good stat for Osmond. But it's already maxed out for the uh, Jackal. Now we just need to get there for the Snail. Joker over here, and man, I got tons of premium chicken from fighting these guys. I might get another one in this chest. Nope, thunder element. Also, why don't we just drink some water? Let me get rid of this. Alright, let's head for the exit, but before we do, we're gonna start piecing up some memories together that I should have done some time ago. So I feel like this is not going to be very progressive in terms of the number of floors. So let's put this on. Also, before we do, let's go to our Georama parts. This is the crowning day, so we just need a bed. We need the father, wherever he is. Not you. Ooh, you'd be a terrible father. Oh, you. And a crow. Wait, crow slot? Huh, that's the crown. And you can actually see them right here. By law and my will, the crown is yours, Noob Saibot, I mean. He proclaims with his last breath. Then I begged his lifeless form. Tell me, father, what should I do as king? I don't know, kingly shit? <laughs> and you can see it again if you want to. Let's go to the night of the ceremony, so let's bring in the moon. Don't crash into the Termina now. Bring the castle. The torch. Another crown, which they still call Crow Slot. And there's Sophia. Let's take a look at that memory. It was the day of my crowning that I met you. Your blue eyes catch mine once and then you vanish. Who on earth are you? That's supposed to be a question. Why'd they end up with a period? Eh, I guess I get too finicky. So there's the bed. And there's the minister. And a... <laughs> and there's Sophia again. And there's the buggy. I want to meet you again. That's all I can think of now. Then the minister rushed into my room in a panic. Princess Buggy of neighbor country is missing in the storm. I reunited with you one hour after that. Oh, that was a very quick memory. They seem to all be very short. You need a horse rider. A sword. And you need a wizard. That's an ugly looking wizard. Looks like something you would see in Tron. Oh, you need the father again. Oh, there he is. That, that thing does not look like a father. It almost looks like a, a golem head. They lie in wait for us, veiled by the morning mist. I give my troops the signal. 
The cavalry slices through. This ferocity before me. Is this war? I thought I heard my father's voice. Do not fear. Your task is to protect this country. Also, why are you holding your sword with your fist? You gotta use your fingers, man. That silhouette's probably the wizard again. A broken sword. I need a horse rider. I need a castle. And Sophia again. Once you fill enough of these, you just know what the silhouettes are. Allies fall. The West has a wizard with fearful power. Are we losing? No! I will not retreat. I must hold here, or those devils will invade your castle. They're people like us, you know. Alright, so what do we gotta do here? The Black Blood. And we don't really have enough here. Yeah, we're, we're missing some things. Oh, the deal! That's what we gotta do. Eh, we'll leave that there. Apparently I skipped one. There we go. Black Robed Man. And the Bloody Agreement. A long time has passed since the war began. We are nearly defeated. To regroup, I took rest at a safe place. And a black robed man approaches from behind the trees. You want the power to win this day? I can give it to you. And we're missing some Georama parts for the dark power. But that will come in time. So we got all the Georama over here. So let us continue on. I feel like we're doing really good, all things considered, and we're actually getting to see some of this backstory of Seda. 162 years ago. You know, we'll just keep playing as Osmond for a little while longer. You know, I actually take back of all the bad things I said about him. He's actually pretty good. If you can actually just build up his weapon, not uh, saying can be said for all characters. He can be one of your best ones. Maybe not as good as Ruby, but still. He's up there. Okay, there's another big chest over here. Oh, man, I opened that on the wrong side. Oh, jeez! If, if you want to kill Osman and you know it, clap your hands. <laughs> well, you did just that. There, let me get another revival powder ready. Can you target him, please? There, he's dead, Jim. And he had the, what I was looking for. All right. Okay, a bomb is not what I was looking for. Let me dash this rash dasher. <laughs> Ridge racer. <laughs> I don't know where I came up with that one. Let's see what this is. Pumped with energy. There, kill those enemies a lot faster. Still need to repair, so I won't be able to take advantage of the stamina that much. But there is very few enemies around this room anyway. Oh, there's one more. There. That's one way to be a heartbreaker. <laughs> Give a rabbit a carrot. That's so funny. Any way you look at it. There's our magical crystal. Alright, everything looks so spread out. Like, everything is literally everywhere. Oh, there's our wizard. Are you a wizard, man? <laughs> hey! I hit you in the back. Why does that not hurt you? Cards are not supposed to be that durable. Oops, I hit square around there. Oh, looks like I'm going to go back to using Osmond. Be careful or you'll fall. I have a helipad on my back. I'm not going to fall. What are you talking about, man? You don't know what's going on, game. <laughs> 
You don't know the places I've been. Thinking I'm gonna fall when I can just levitate? Seriously? Oh, there's our light. That's for the uh, next memory. The one I thought I was currently on, and then I realized, oh, I'm one ahead. Good thing I corrected myself there. Uh, we're better off just going up first. Just to clear out those enemies, or at least see what's in that chest. I may not be able to clear all of them, all things considered, but it may not be a bad idea either. God, that glitch is so annoying. Ugh, all that for a gooey peach. You know what, we're very close to leveling up this weapon, so I might as well fight these three enemies. Uh -huh, you missed. The gun is so much stronger when you're up close. It feels like you're getting more of your shots in there. Oh, that's so aggravating. But there we go. We only need two more absorption points, really. Oh, that's right, we didn't even explore the southwest part, so we'll get that here. Then we're going to have to start using the snail more often. Oh, our drain's feather broke. And we're going to need some water. Thank God I didn't say our water broke, because that would have been the most awkward sentence of all time. Given that we're playing as a male character. Oh, jeez, I can only carry three more items. So I got a lot of chicken to sell. I might as well just call myself KFC. And it just gives me another one. Alright, let's upgrade. I'm gonna miss the jackal. It served us well. But at the end of the day, we do need to move on. I'm not gonna use my gems for this. I'll just use whatever attachments I can actually buy. Metal breakers and uh, mimic breakers I don't think you can buy. So they're a little bit more you want to protect, if need be. Okay, guess we're gonna be sticking with the snail from now on. Okay, that should be good. We still got max attack and speed. So what is he gonna need to build up? Okay, a little bit of everything in the element side. But it looks like it's just the elements, then, for that one. Yeah, he doesn't really need anything in Anti-Monster. That could be good. So I better focus on what exactly I want to keep. Oops, I need to actually equip the snail. But I got the machine gun equipped, and I don't want that. Okay, it's a little bit weirder to use, but it works. It does a little bit more damage. Granted, it's a single shot attack, but we can live with it. They won't be able to. If we just kill them. There's our castle. Okay, I kind of like this little setup. You actually get to see memories just by completing events. Too bad you didn't get to do that more, but like the other ones. Okay, this is the dark power. So we need the wizard. We need the light. We need the castle. Oh, but we still need Sophia. And we used up all our Giorama parts right now. We'll have to get more. We'll probably find Sophia on the next floor. And I'm not talking about Gene Simmons' daughter either. Okay, I think that's going to be enough progress for this particular episode. We did really good. Now I'm just going to think about what gems will be good for, like, elements and whatnot. Or attributes rather than anti-monster. We need to power up Osman's weapon. We'll think about that in the next episode, alright? So, see you later everyone. Thanks for watching.